Avoid ginger if you have these health problems. Do you want to start living a more healthy lifestyle? Well, you've reached the right place for some health tips that may just improve your life. Did you know that ginger is one of the most nutritious plants? Its active components, gingerol and shackles, have a plethora of health benefits. It has also been used for centuries as a natural remedy for a multitude of medical conditions. Although it has powerful antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties, there are four groups of people who should avoid it for medical reasons. Now, keep watching who should avoid eating ginger based on the condition they have, as well as other health tips so you can start living a more healthy lifestyle. Before we begin this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more daily tips like this and turn on notifications so you never miss our new videos. Number four, blood disorders. People who have blood disorders should stay away from using ginger. While ginger boosts the circulation of blood and can be helpful to those suffering from conditions like obesity and peripheral artery disease, it can be harmful to those who have hemophilia or those whose blood isn't able to clot normally, according to CureJoy.com. Essentially, ginger doesn't allow the medication used to treat those conditions to work. Since ginger stimulates the circulation and increases blood flow, it has the potential of increasing the risk of bleeding. That is especially the case for those who already have bleeding disorders or take any medication that slows blood clotting. Number three, people taking certain medications. Those who use certain drugs to treat conditions like diabetes or hypertension should speak to their doctor before drinking ginger tea or incorporating ginger into their diet. This is because many ginger teas interfere with the medical effect of insulin, anticoagulants, or beta blockers. According to Medicine Plus, a medical service of the National Institutes of Health, ginger can also interact negatively with other drugs, such as antacids, heart medication, and antihistamines. Speaking of ginger, keep watching until the end because we'll tell you about a special ginger recipe you can make that can help remove mucus from your lungs and cure a bad cough. Number two, if you are underweight. If you are underweight or battling anorexia, you should avoid using ginger. For those looking to lose weight, ginger is helpful because it's loaded with fiber and has the capability to boost the secretions of digestive enzymes and stomach pH levels as well as suppress appetite. However, According to thehardysoul.com, for those who are underweight, ginger can lead to poor muscle mass and further weight loss. Number one, if you are pregnant. If you are pregnant, you should not include ginger in your diet. While ginger can help digestion during pregnancy, it has the ability to stimulate premature contractions and even labor. It also disrupts the intake of dietary iron and fat-soluble vitamins. According to the book, The 100 Healthiest Foods to Eat During Pregnancy, copious amounts of ginger during pregnancy can cause miscarriage or menstrual bleeding. Although it helps to combat morning sickness, doctors recommend avoiding it until at least the last trimester of pregnancy. Now that you know who should avoid eating ginger, here is a ginger recipe for all of you out there who eat ginger regularly and are looking for some more added health benefits of ginger. This recipe will help remove mucus from your lungs and cure a bad cough. Dr. Axe defines ginger as a plant that comes from rhizomes, which are underground stems which grow horizontally and form roots with new stems and leaves that grow on the top. In regards to ginger benefits and health benefits, Dr. Axe says that ginger has been globally used as a natural remedy for thousands of years because of its medicinal properties. With that said, there are many ways to use ginger. It can be used fresh from the ground or even in capsule form. According to the Organic Health Corner, people can even use wrapped ginger to remove mucus from your lungs or even cure a cough. You're probably wondering why ginger can remove mucus and cure a cough. According to RxMed website, 
One of the reasons it's so effective with mucus and coughs is because it contains oleoresin. Oleoresin has antitussive abilities, which means it can suppress and relieve coughs. They also state that ginger contains aromatic compounds like phenylalkyl ketones, which are gingerols, shaugols, and zingarone. Together, they can soothe a cough. It also helps break down toxins in the body, which can form mucus if not broken down or removed. In order to make wrapped ginger, you'll need to follow ingredients. Organic honey, one tablespoon of ginger powder or grated ginger, olive oil, flour, gauze, a napkin, and adhesive tape. Once you have successfully gathered all the ingredients, it's now time to prepare wrapped ginger. Begin by mixing flour and honey together in a bowl. Then add olive oil and ginger and mix it all together again. Once you've thoroughly mixed the ingredients together, put the paste on a napkin and wrap it in the gauze. Once you've done all of that, apply it to a person's chest and stick it with an adhesive tape. Leave it on for three hours before going to bed so the mixture has time to work. According to Organic Health Corner, the Organic Health Corner explains that there are no side effects to this remedy aside from skin irritation. Because of the powerful effects of ginger, it can irritate the skin. So what you can do to minimize the chances of that is to add more honey to the wrap, says Organic Health Corner. Other Health Benefits of Ginger Ginger doesn't just help with coughs and mucus, it also has many other ginger benefits. One benefit is that it can fight fungal infections. In 2016, a test tube study was conducted by researchers from Iran, and they found that ginger was effective against two types of yeast that commonly cause fungal infections in the mouth. Eases menstrual pain. For women, pain, period cramps, and headaches are among the most common side effects that are associated with menstrual pain. Instead of turning to over-the-counter medications, try something more natural, like ginger. According to a study that was published in the Journal of Alternative and Complementary Medicine, ginger was just as effective at removing menstrual pain as ibuprofen and mephanamic acid. Lower Cholesterol Levels our cholesterol helps produce bile and manufacture our hormones, so it's essential to our overall health. But when we have high cholesterol, it can cause blockages and increase your risk of heart disease. According to a study at Babel University of Medical Sciences, Ginger was able to reduce the bad LDL cholesterol and also raise the beneficial HDL cholesterol. So if you have high cholesterol levels and want to know what you can do to improve your cholesterol, Consider adding ginger to your diet and see if it helps improve your cholesterol levels. All in all, a change to your diet that includes healthier foods that are nutritious will also improve other parts of your health and contribute to a healthy lifestyle. On the whole, if you are currently dealing with any of these conditions or have experienced them in the past, you should consult your doctor first before incorporating ginger into your diet. If you want to start living a more healthy lifestyle, Try to follow some of the health tips in this video. If you have certain conditions, you may want to speak to a doctor first before taking any medical advice or making any changes to your diet. Remember, your health starts with you. So if you want to make a change in your life, consider doing some things that will benefit your healthy lifestyle and improve your overall quality of life. Enjoyed this video? Hit the like button and share with your friends. Also, Subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.